Hey there, Hair Collective. Welcome to my page. Thank you for watching as always. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe, share uh, to support the channel so that it can grow. So let's go ahead and get into our story. Um, so what we have here is someone that's wanting to possibly give a feminine energy something, uh, possibly a financial offer or just uh, something to get them out of a situation that is really uh, not healthy. So someone could be going through some financial difficulties at the moment, and there could be someone that's watching you and is aware of what is going on, or there is just someone that wants to bring balance into a situation. So there could have been some type of financial situation uh, that was stolen from you, whether it was a job opportunity, uh, a, a financial payout there was something that was stolen from you or was blocked from being given to you it could have been an inheritance something of the sort but there is someone in the situation that wants to bring balance into it um to kind of clear things up someone could be having some really heavy karma that is sitting on them or following them around um, but they are wanting to bring balance into a situation there could be some legalities going on with this um, the courts could be involved. Someone could have impersonated another person in order to prevent them from receiving their blessings. It's like someone was trying to steal another person's inheritance. I don't know if maybe someone had lost a loved one or something, or someone something was just passed down to you or whoever this is in regards to, and someone made sure that it did not make its way to you. Someone could have stolen some money, a house, uh, just something that was meant to be given to you but someone in this situation or a group of people went above and beyond to prevent this from making it to you as you can see we have the five of swords out here this means that there is someone behind the scenes that is still fighting to prevent this offer this blessing this inheritance from making it to you there is someone that gets a weird sense of pleasure from causing misery to other people especially you someone has a very strong disdain for you for some reason this is someone that is just egotistical someone that gets off on stealing from other people tricking other people just making other people's lives miserable um someone is also extremely jealous all right we're dealing with a jealous energy and this could be a masculine energy or a feminine energy it does not matter but whoever this five of source energy is they are extremely malicious um, they are really just set on you not receiving this financial blessing, right? Someone feels like you receiving this financial blessing is unfair to them, even though it has nothing to do with them, right? This is not taken from their pocket, from their mouth in any way. This blessing doesn't have anything to do with them at all. But because they are aware of it and they know what difference it's going to make in your life, someone wants you to stay in a deplorable state. So if you're going through some type of financial setback right now, they want you to stay in that energy. But it's not the energy that is meant for you, okay? So this is uh, the emotional state of the situation that is going on, especially for you. You could be facing a lot of difficulties at the moment, right? And this financial blessing is something that will give you a new beginning, a fresh start, right? So they, this would take you out of this state of destitute poverty, whatever it is you're going through. This, is, this would take you out of that state of being and put you in a new light. Someone here, this person, they are not happy about this to use a light term right it, for lack of better words they just are not having it someone is set on you not receiving this and they have been doing things behind the scenes interfering with uh any type of motions people have been taking to bring this financial offers to your attention and things like that or even this opportunity to your attention there could be someone that wants to work with you and there are people in the background telling this person not to work with you as well in the past there could have been someone here uh, we have the star card out here and i'm going to cover it back up because of the nudity in the past there was someone that saw you as wish fulfillment right this person saw you as someone that was kind-hearted very pure light-hearted 
uh, very giving and things like that. And this person believed that they could have equal give and take with you in uh, either a business situation or a romantic uh, situation um, and things like that. Someone wanted to speak the truth to you. Someone also was watching you and knew that you were telling the truth about a situation. They were not uh, accepting the truth for a while. This is like someone that was living in denial for quite a while. Um, but they were watching you and knew that you were speaking and found out that you were speaking the truth. Um, and then they made a move on that and found out kind of to legitimize what they heard. So it's like you said something really outrageous. Um, and then someone decides, you know what, I'm going to go and look into that. And then when they look into it, they find out that you're actually telling the truth. Uh, so now there is some type of maybe investigation going on, some type of balance being brought into the situation. Someone is realizing that something was taken from you or from someone else in the situation and they want to bring balance into it. This person knows that if they give you this opportunity, this blessing makes its way to you, it's going to put you in a beautiful energy in life, right? This person could secretly be wanting to have wish fulfillment with you as well. This is someone that is financially stable in life. And they want to, you know, extend a helping hand to you, basically. So this is someone within this group that's coming out of this toxic family dynamic group or wherever this is. They are coming out of this, right? Because they've seen the truth for what it is. They're no longer wa walking around with a blindfold on, a voluntary blindfold on. They're, they have taken the blindfold off and are moving forward. In the near future, you can expect to have abundance in your life. Someone is seeing you exactly for who you are. Someone is going to see you as the true empress. And if I'm saying that, then that means that there was someone that was pretending to be an empress in order to have access to this financial blessing, right? But the truth has been revealed. So someone in the near future is going to be able to see the truth of the matter as well. See you for who you are. Know that people were lying on you. Know that you are someone extremely abundant, someone nurturing, someone kind someone extremely family focused and things like that. Um, so they know that you are abundant and they themselves is abundant and they, they're going to want to come together with you. Um, you are kind of making progress in your financial life or just overall in life, right? So right now, this is where you are and then you're making it here to the star energy. So you may, be, you may end up in the, on a public platform of being, you know, really financially stable, you may receive some type of job opportunity that's going to put you in a beautiful light where you'll be making a lot of money. And this is going to put you in your empress energy, right? Um, so you, you can kind of see how you are progressing in this situation as well. Uh, there is some type of fear of you, this person, there is a fear of them, um, wondering like if they connect with you if you are going to leave them behind you know once you become stable and things like that with the magician out here this person knows that you are extremely powerful you're you're so, someone extremely good at manifesting using your mental you have a lot a lot of mental power right to bring things into the natural world you're someone that has taken charge of your life you're no longer living in fear uh, you have kind of made your debut to the world with the star energy out here and the magician card out here. You have kind of made your debut. You're not hiding anymore. You're not hiding who you are, what you can do. You don't care what people know about you, don't know about you, um, and things like that. This person is hoping to move forward with you. They're hoping that them coming to you and giving to you is going to make things a little bit easier between the two of you. And they're hoping that you two can work together and move forward in life, right? Uh, so this is what um, they are hoping for. <clears throat> there are people around this person that are extremely heartbroken about them wanting to be with you or having anything to do with you because these were people in the background they were doing things to prevent this person from coming to you with this offer and things like that so there are people in here that are taking it extremely personal even though it's not affecting them in any way maybe they were stealing from this masculine or this feminine energy in some way somehow as well so they know that if this person connects with you, all of that is coming to an end. So they feel betrayed. 
um someone is just the energy from someone specifically in this reading is just a little bit too intense to even deal with i don't want to sit in it but someone here is just extremely malicious it says someone has lost touch with their heart space they don't operate from their heart space anymore so everything they do comes from like the, like their root chakra is overused at this point um someone is just extremely bitter and it's really sad to see someone living in this type of energy okay uh so they're heartbroken about this union you you can expect to be getting married someone is going to be getting married okay it can be you or someone that you are related to related to or whoever this message uh relates to right but you are going to be getting married um you can expect that after you and this person get acquainted with one another okay this is something that you are secretly desiring yourself and this is something that person is also desiring is to have a stable connection with someone a genuine connection one that is bountiful one that is fruitful uh reciprocity things like that so you both have the same desires to get married married right and this is what's going to happen you two are going to be like in your own little world once you get married it's like the rest of the world is not really going to matter to you you two are going to really be focused on each other just kind of building building a life um for yourselves uh regardless of what is going on in this situation um there this person is choosing to keep going right like keep coming towards you even though people are fighting them behind the scenes and trying to block them this person is not letting fear hold them back so they're still going to walk this long path this lonely path and make it to you regardless of who distances themselves from this person they're still going to come towards you right um because they know that this is a, a union that is meant to be they know that this is a union that's going to heal them someone is not living in anxiety anymore this is why we have the moon card out here there is something that you are going to be finding out about when this person comes towards you they are coming towards you not just to give you a financial opportunity but to clarify some things to you about a situation from the past as well okay so you can expect some clarity uh, right now you don't know everything that's been going on but this person knows something about a situation that took place and they want to come in and clarify that for you so that's what you can expect i'm going to pull a few more cards so we can get a little bit more clarity on here and see what um what else you can expect i, I really want to know what is this secret that you don't know what, does it possibly have to do with what people were doing in the background that you are not aware of what kind of financial opportunity was taken from you is it that this masculine is a business owner and wanted to give you some type of business opportunity and these people blocked it or were they trying oh yeah it was a new beginning it was a new beginning they were blocking uh, they were blocking a new beginning it was supposed to be an offer that was supposed to be given to you right like a business opportunity work opportunity some type of opportunity was supposed to be given to you but they did it they did something to block this person from giving it to you because they felt that they were more deserving of it someone on here feels extremely entitled they don't care how they get things how they don't get it whether they work for it or they didn't work for it they still feel entitled to it there is someone here that's like a jizzy bill energy okay so we could possibly even be talking about a feminine energy that's in this five of swords uh energy as well feeling entitled to things that they do not deserve because but because they want to live the good life and they don't care how they go about living their good life they will take from other people still this is like someone that was cloaking themselves in another person's energy and it's really sad to see that uh let's see what else yeah can I get clarity on this Ace of Wands, please? Okay. All right. It is just the God's honest truth. Uh, someone is afraid that you're going to cut them off. Like you're going to tell them to speak to, to, to you're going to listen to what they have to say. Um, but they're afraid that you're going to cut them off after they speak the truth to you. And this offer is long overdue. It's long overdue. 
but i'm gonna leave it here i'll see you all in the next reading goodbye for now